Thanks for joining us on Turtle Time again. Today we're going to look at the Chinese soft shell turtle. So we just have a little look down here. Soft shell turtles, I call that because they don't have the hard shell that you'd normally find on most turtles. It's more of a rubbery, leathery sort of skin. And one advantage to having no shell is that you're much lighter and it can swim a lot faster than most turtles. It's also got four really big paddled feet, almost like a pleosaur, and you'll see that when I pick him out. So again, it can, it's really manoeuvrable and really fast. Now this is handy because it naturally catches fish, and fish are extremely hard to catch. Another adaptation that it's got is an extremely long neck, so it can shoot that out and it can grab a fish and take it by surprise. Now we're going to try and pick him up. If you want to have a look at him down here, he's moved away from me now. We're going to try and pick him up. You can probably see his big flippers and his long neck when he's climbing about. I found some are down there. Another thing that you often find with soft-shell turtles is they can have skin problems. And to try and combat that, we keep him in a bit of sediment at the bottom, sand and soil. That's very good for the skin. Right, let's see if we'll come out and have a, have a look at it. I have to be careful, because they're renowned for being a bit bitey and aggressive. Soft-shell turtles. Can you see him there? Now he's a big one. I'll try and turn him around. Does anyone want to sort of quickly touch him? Like oh, a barrister. What's he feel like? Mm, Do you want to have a go? What's he feel like? Like a barrister. can be a bit slippery, because they don't really come out that often to bask. So they're always wet and a bit slimy. Let him go there. I feel his clothes are extremely tight. Now, I've got a question I think is coming here from Stephen. Uh, the question is, uh, do soft shells shed uh, their uh, skin, uh, sorry, their scoots? Uh, or... They don't. They don't have scoots because it is just one skin that goes all the way over them. So, what they'll do is they'll grow in that skin. It's much more pliable than, uh, than the hard shell scoots. Uh, I've got another question here from Tara as well. Tara says, do these live in salt water or fresh water? Good question, Tara. They live in fresh water, although some, of the, some species can actually live in brackish water. That means a bit salty. And it is actually uh, being recorded many times that the Nile soft shell, which is a huge animal, which can get to this sort of size, they swim out the Nile Delta but across the Mediterranean Ocean. And they lay their eggs on beaches, just like sea turtles do, uh, in Turkey, and I think on some of the Greek islands as well. So let's have one last little uh, look at the soft shell turtle. Let's see if he'll come out again. Will he come out? Maybe. Maybe not. I don't think he's going to come. So we'll just say bye-bye from the soft shell turtle. See you next time.